Today I received a package from Days Records. This is a, an American record company that releases some very interesting um, new uh, albums, sometimes also a, an old one. Um, so I wanted to show you a few I bought from them. So let's put uh, the album from Francis Bacon aside. I recommend you actually to visit it in London if you're going to be there in Royal Academy. Really great exhibition. I bought an album for this. Um, but this is the package. It's from the US. So before recording the video, I wanted to check if actually albums are inside. Uh, so I open it, and yes, here we go. Um, so the box is really nice, actually. I thought uh, that maybe not enough, but all long plays survived. The first one, uh, the first album is Adult, uh, from the band Adult, called Perception. Um, I listened music to all of them just to check if I like it and yeah, this was really great one So Yeah, I don't know if I should show you something more about it. I don't know exactly what is this. I just uh, Heard like uh, 30 seconds of each song just to check if it's in my style and I really like it All of the music I'm going to present to you is in kind of new wave uh, dark wave whatever you name it 80s style but some of the bands are actually new and i think this adult is actually a pretty new band and they're playing the, with this old kind of atmospheric sound which i really like okay pink turns blue this is actually an old german band uh, i really uh, like uh, another album from them but this one is actually is quite haunting. I really like uh, the visuals uh, and the sounds it really um, depicts what's on the picture, uh, what's, what, what you see here. So yeah, it's pretty cool, I think. Originally released in 88 and released uh, 2019 by DICE. I know how to uh, actually uh, pronunciate it, but I think it's DICE Records. D -A I guess. It's really great that actually they are uh, doing this stuff. Um, this is another album from the past, Cindy Talk. I really like uh, Cindy Talk by... Um, yeah, I learned about, uh, about it uh, via 4AD uh, when I uh, bought another album back then. I don't remember exactly the name, but... Uh, there was a Gordon Sharp. Now it's uh, now uh, they changed uh, sex, I think. Uh, and this music is really, really great. This came from US, but actually I see that it's made in Czech Republic. That's funny. This is a little bit uh, crazy album, but um, yeah, I really like this sounds. I have another album. Camouflage for heart, or yeah, <laughs> probably I will fix it later. Uh, how it's really called, I don't remember the details. And it's a really great album. And this one was released in 1995, so actually, the, the, the Camouflage, the other album is from 80s something, but uh, this one is a little bit different, different sounds and so on. But still, uh, the voice is, uh, is amazing, it's the same voice of uh, Gordon Sharp. Um, so I really like it. Um, this one I really don't remember, but I really like it, so I just bought it. Soul Possession. Nice cover. You see. Okay. Mm. Let me think about this album. 83, that, that's when it was uh, recorded at Southern Studios in Summer. Summer is a place or... A <laughs> It was just, uh, I think, uh, and all uh, lyrics by Annie Anxiety. Anxiety. So actually, ah, this is Annie Anxiety, exactly. I remember now. I really like it, actually. 
it's it's out of anything I know I think it's really different um, so I think this is maybe I'm wrong because I didn't listen too much but yeah I went through stuff like Nina Hagen um, and a few others uh, which I don't remember right now because uh, my memory is good but short um, Wow, ah, Toya, for example, uh, or the Sugar Cubes where Bjork started, but this is different, this is different, uh, different sounds, really fresh, I was really excited when I heard the, the, the few minutes of it, and I was like, I'm going to get it, for sure, so here you go, another one, what is it, uh, yeah, I did some, actually, yeah, maybe I should start from the album, which is somewhere below. Yeah, I wanted actually to buy uh, this uh, VR Sex, not this album specifically, but the other one. Um, um, but this one was only available. So then I said, okay, if I'm buying one, then I will get uh, a few more. And this is how what happened. I bought a few others. Um, so let's continue. Unknown to the eye. Ultraviolet Saturn uh, Incorporated. What is this about? I don't know. 2015 cassette EP from Drop Majesty remastered and issued to vinyl for the first time ever. Includes the songs Unknown to the Eye and Ultra Ultraviolet. I don't know. Uh, I don't remember exactly uh, why I took this one, but there is a there must be a reason um okay this one it's an hardcore actually i was not sure if i want it because i'm listening to this kind of noise music but i really like the 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 way how the structure of percussion is done and the, the whole layers this is hide interior terror i heard other albums as well but i decided just to get this one it's creepy, it's uh, unsettling and so on, but yeah, there is something which just I thought like I have to uh, try and listen more of this, like industrial, but not really an industrial only. Like I was thinking, uh, it's a minimalistic, like big, uh, the one where uh, the side project of um, percussist, I guess. From uh, Portishead, I I might I might lie. I'm not a musician, um, like a reviewer or any kind of uh, guy who you should listen to for uh, any recommendations. Uh, but yeah, this is what I what I what I think it's about. It's this kind of music, but still more unsettling and uh, much different, more noisy. Yeah, VR sex, really, really uh, great music, I would say. They are from LA, I guess. Or was it something over there? I don't know, I'm in European, so for me, uh, yeah, something like talking, uh, telling where's Los Angeles and where's uh, another city, it's like uh, saying that. Uh, uh, for Americans, probably, <laughs> without generalizing, of course, it's uh, West Paris or another city or a country. Mm, so really hard to guess for me uh, and remember. But I think in LA there is a lot of stuff happening because I have a uh, Lucian Champagne for the, from them from there, uh, which is an album from eighties. But still, this kind of music is is really fresh what what's happening the scene in Los Angeles I think it's it's really interesting this one I'm not sure if it's Los Angeles but still I don't remember also the other song I would pr probably uh, let you know anyways but uh, yeah I decided okay let's get this one it's fun it's a good good there are good uh, lyrics so I'm going this one and the last one this was actually a surprise I was not going to, to get it but then I I give it a second chance and then I said, wow, this is actually um, interesting. This is like a Cocteau Twins slash, yeah, this is like a dream pop music. 
they say it's something about that can dance which I never relate I think that can dance is much different than Cocteau Twins it's not the same category for me Kate Bush yeah maybe maybe I don't know I need to listen to this and that's all this is the whole package yeah let's make some noise so uh, this one is SRSQ uh, album uh, Unreality I'm not sure from when when and so on but it's quite new and of course a lot of them I didn't mention that a lot of them are like limited edition the same was for VR sex there was like 400 uh, 400 of them in one version then there was like a vinyl was like a not I don't re remember exactly but it was like a clear vinyl then you can have like a white or any other versions and yeah um, no copies were available and in this case also there were like 400 of these so I just got this one um, and yeah I wanted to share all of that uh, vinyls with you because um, yeah this is uh, something I listened to and would like to just share that with you and also maybe I would be interested to to try this stuff it's quite interesting and it's really great that this kind of style which resonates with me um, which is yeah something which I really like about music uh, when it's um, when it sounds like 80s when it's a lo-fi and this kind of music uh, something a little bit niche which I think it shouldn't be that niche but probably if it would be the niche then it it would be rotten with uh, some influences uh, that uh, are not making this music that special um, so yeah that's all uh, thank you for watching uh, my another um, uh, random access memory and I will check all the albums and if you have any uh, questions yeah please uh, let me know about it. Uh, I'm going to listen some now um, because this uh, silence <laughs> uh, is uh, that's I think that's enough for the silence. Uh, so let's let's make some uh, some nice uh, introductory. I think yeah maybe I should try with this anxiety uh, arm or arm anxiety. I don't remember. Exactly, an anxiety, an anxiety. Yeah, I think I will try with this one. It's really hard to start uh, when you have so many albums. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be a DJ a little bit and just try to 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 probably set some <laughs> uh, order. I was thinking about pink turns blue though. Hmm. Yeah, but yeah, I think I'm really interested with uh, any anxiety. Maybe I should leave it to the end as a as like a cherry on the cake. Well, I don't know <laughs> hard decisions. Okay, uh, I'm joking. Uh, thank you for watching and uh, let's check uh, check dice if you want. It's it you can listen to music on their page. Um, yeah, it's quite interesting. Not for everyone, for sure, but yeah, maybe you will find something for yourself. Thanks, and see you in future.